Good morning and today we're gonna do something with my cat actually three of them and as we have learned from the past years they fight a lot and we decided not to take those necklaces anymore that they sell in the pet shops because Evie stay because if you put them those on they cannot take them off it looks like I'm struggling with her but that's how they fight so it doesn't come off but if we do the ones that I'm making it comes off and she's able to leave. I'm not only gonna show you how to make safe necklaces for your cats, but also how to reuse your old underwears or socks. But make sure they're washed because you know, cats have a sensitive nose. Even if you have old t-shirts that you don't need anymore or they are broken and you cannot sell them, or if you even know how to sew, you can just take parts of fabric and just, I'll show you how to do it. I'm gonna show you how to do it from a sock. Preferably you could even use three socks that would look nicer, you will see why. So first we're gonna need three different type of color socks, that would be the best. Let's start with the first one. So we need to cut those two sides. Those two pieces we don't need. We're gonna work with this one. Cut it in the middle and now we're gonna open it and cut it all in stripes. So let's move on to the other two socks and we're gonna do the same exact thing. Perfect. So now we're gonna take from each string, we're gonna use one color. We're gonna pull them. They might some fabric fall around but we need to pull them, it's really important because you will see the difference. That's pretty much the difference. You're getting like kind of the double the size because they wrinkle and it's easier to do the next step. So, even if you don't know how to sew, you can use a safety needle and put them together. Way faster, but not that 100% secured. You just take a simple needle, put a string through and sew the two ends together. It literally just needs two, three stitches just to hold them together. So that's what we're gonna do now. So now we're gonna stitch them all together. It's super easy, If you even if you don't know how to stitch, it's just, you pull it in, out. And that's what we will do. So they're good together. So now that is done, they're all hanging from one string. So now if you wanna make a simple one, a quick one, you can go ahead and just get from your socks, underwear or a fabric, make a simple knot and you have already a necklace. That looks a bit poopy, but for us, they go down so they have adventures, so they lose them all the time. So for us, it's not a big deal. And it's super easy to put it on. Just go ahead. They know that it's your cut if, they, if it goes outside. And super easy if she gets stuck on a tree, falls down and doesn't get stuck on her throat. So that was a small one. Ooh, you're a good model. So let's go sell the other ones to a bit nicer one that Nelly will wear because she doesn't go downstairs. You can also let your cat have fun at it <laughs> if it wants and if it doesn't mess up too many things. Well, now she left because she realized she's messing up. Didn't you, Nelly? Oh, you can stay with me. You can see how I'm making a nice necklace for you. Look. It's going to be for you because you don't go downstairs and lose them every day. Right? You need a nice one. Go ahead and do the old school on the hair. Wriggles. I don't know, twisty. I don't know if you can see it. And you might need help from someone, a friend, boyfriend, mom, someone just to hold it for you and pull it stronger so it stretches even more while you're doing it. So now we're done, that's the end result, but we need to tie the two ends together. You don't need to, perf you don't need to do a knot there, you can just take them and do a knot with it, so you don't have too many knots. Come on. And just pull it. Pull it as much as you can. And if you don't like the ends, I usually keep them because they look like a small, I don't know, they look pretty cool. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut the end that we saw them together. That was just for simple, you don't need to do that. It was just for easier so you can sew it because we don't want to have too many knots you see so we only have like two sides if you don't know how to sew if you cannot do it well if I do it you can do it and there's perfectly Nelly coming in my scene Be model. and just put it in and make sure that you can pull it therefore you see already comes off if I pull it a bit put it on that's nicer than the one you have Nelly goes super easy on and if she gets strangled on something she's gonna fight it fight it Nelly show them that you can take it off there you go perfect pretty safe so take the old one off no 
Oh, so cute! Look how beautiful she looks. Don't fight me, I just made you a nice necklace. Say thank you. So that's how easy... Really? So that's how easy it was. So depending what you have at home, we have a drawer full of buttons. You can sew a button on it, or you can use another colorful buttons that I have. We have also a bell, so we can hear her coming. You just put it together when you do that together. You put a string, like an elastic one, and you sew, do it together, that you twist it together pretty much, and put the bell in. So you can also have a bell, or you can put whatever your creativity wants. Like whatever you have at home and looks cool or looks cute, you can put it on. I'm not gonna decorate them because as I said, they lose them. So for me, decorating something nice and then to lose them is no point. For her, I could do a nicer one, because she's not losing them. Actually, she's fighting and she loses it. So that's pretty much it. You need to show them your boom boom. Do you like it, Nelly? Do you like it? Hey, don't slap me. Go back to your seat. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I would love to see the necklaces you did for your cuts by just tagging us and using the hashtag do be diff. I would love to see what you did and how creative you got. I'm not gonna get that creative as I said because they just lose it. It's so annoying that I cannot do something creative for them. Right? So, we we'll see you next time. Say bye bye.